Hello friends, this video on basic geometrical ideas part 13 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So now that we have got an idea about curves and angles, it is very important that we start talking about something more interesting that is polygon. What is polygon? Poly, the word poly means many. So and what do we mean by polygon? So basically this is going to be those shapes which have multiple sides. Now think of certain things around us like you look at your blackboard. When you look at your blackboard, what is the shape of your blackboard? It is like it, it is somewhat of the shape, right? If you observe the boundary of the uh, blackboard, you can see that there are lines outside. You think of a book. So there also when you look at the shape of your book, you see that there are lines involved. You think of a window pane, you think of the kite. So everywhere you can see that certain lines and all of them together, they form a new shape altogether. So polygon is a simple closed curve made up of only line segments. That means you will not have any curve as such. That means you will only, we will only deal with straight lines here. So straight lines forming a closed curve and that too a simple closed curve. By now you all know what is a simple curve. That means a curve which doesn't intersect itself. And closed curve means it, it doesn't have the end point and the start point. There is no concept of end point start point. It would be an enclosed uh, curve. But this is made up of only line segments. So some examples of polygons. So we, you see a lot of varieties of curves on the screen. So which one of these is a polygon and which one is not? So this would be a very good exercise to understand what exactly is a polygon. Now this is very important because a lot of times people get confused that uh, I mean which, di which image or which picture represents a polygon and which doesn't. So let us look at the number one. So look at this image. Do you think it is a closed curve? Yes, it is a closed curve because it is closed from all ends. Do you think it is a simple curve? Yes, that's because it doesn't cross over itself. So it is a simple, uh, it is a simple curve as well. Do you think it is made up of only line segments? Yes, that is also true. This is one line segment. This is another line segment. This one is yet another line segment and this is also a line segment. So basically it satisfies all the three criteria. It is a simple curve. It is a closed curve and it is made up of only line segments. If all the three criteria are satisfied, then that is a polygon. So one is a polygon. What about two? Two is also a closed curve. It is also a simple curve, but when you look at the line segments, is it made up of only line segments? One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six line segments which is forming this curve. So this is also a polygon. What about three? Three again is a closed curve. It is also a simple curve because it is not crossing over itself and it is made up of line segments. So this one is also a polygon. Fourth. Here this is a closed curve of course. Is it a simple curve? Yes it is. Is it made up of only line segments? No it is not made up of line segments. Therefore it is not a polygon. So this is not a polygon. What is this? This is basically a circle. But since this is not made up of line segments so it is not a polygon. Look at number 9. What about number 9? Here if you look at it again this is a closed curve but again it is not made up of line segments so this is also not a polygon. If you look at number 6 this one is also a closed curve simple curve but not made up of line segments therefore this is not a polygon. Now let us look at number 12. Now number 12 is a closed curve, yes, it is also made up of line segments because these are lines 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. But I say that it is still not a polygon, why? Because it is not a simple curve, because the curve is crossing over itself, the curve intersects itself. Therefore this is not a simple curve and therefore this is not a polygon. So in this way, I am sure that you will be able to identify which one is a polygon and which one is not. In fact, all the others are polygons. So these are all polygons because they are simple closed curves made up of only line segments. 
Thank you. Please visit examfear.com for free quality education. You can learn with a simple four step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons, you can ask your questions, you can refer notes and you can take a free online test. We have content for class 6 to 12 on physics, chemistry, mathematics and biology along with practical videos. So please subscribe to our channel for daily updates. Thank you.